Hello Zebraherd, welcome back to Sonic Origins. In the last episode, Eggman betrayed Knuckles, stealing the Super Emerald in both Hidden Palace Zone and Sky Sanctuary Zone. We defeated Mecha Sonic, and now we're moving to the next area, the Death Egg Zone. Let's get started. Okay, I'm ready to kick some Eggman butt for one final time. We're in the Death Egg once again. Like we, we really technically haven't been in the Death Egg since Sonic 2, right? I don't know if we actually went into it in the first portion of Sonic 3, uh, which is technically what Sonic 3 is, and then this is Sonic and Knuckles, or whatever. But either way, it looks so cool in here. I love the the, the interior. Looks awesome, that's not so good. Um, but as per usual, I'll try my best to be diligent and, oh no, how do I make that jump? Ooh, it almost got me. There we go. Uh, I'll do my best to try to get 50 rings here so that we can survive and, have hypersonic as an option. But for right now, the goal is just to get through everything. And now I have this, so I can hop up here. Ooh, no problem, no problem. But this area is super cool, I'm just hyped up to get through it. Come on, Sonic, we can do this. Oh no, this is a conveyor belt. Whoa, I didn't even see that thing. That's a problem. So there's a lot of traps in this level so far. I'm trying to avoid as many of them as I can. So we get sent up this way. This little anti-gravity chamber, or whatever in the world this is. We got it. Ooh, I almost got hurt. No, I thought I... <laughs> okay, I was trying to time the jump, so I didn't get hit, and I got hit instead. How do I get up there? Um, I guess like that? Oh, that hurts me too, huh? All right, well, good to know. We were so close to 50 rings, but we'll earn it back up. We'll figure it out. Gotta avoid all those as much as I can, but what do we do? Oh, okay, I grab onto it. Now oh, I see. That was good. Heading up here. Three, two, one, go. Whoa! We're just floating around. I did see a couple of items there. I don't know if we'll be able to get to them. Cause I don't know where in the world we're going. Can I control this? Can I do anything? I don't think I can. That was wild. So I'm actually gonna go back cause I would like to get some of those things if possible. Um, let's get rid of you. Yeah, and then, not that, uh-oh. Here we go, here we go. Let's get to these, one, two, and three. And then up this way, aha, that was a good move then, for sure. So now I can just go back to where we were, right? Maybe not exactly, but pretty close to it. And now we're, we're pretty much along the way, I think. So I guess we're going down here now. Ooh, there we go. It's really hard to control this. Like, it probably looks easier than it is. No, you don't. So I have to dodge those little missiles. Ah, oh, come on. So I won't be able to keep my shield. But we're so close. We're so close. Not anymore. There is so much happening. Oh no. Um. Whoa. Whoa, invincibility? Okay, don't mind if I do. I just didn't know that was down there. So I'm just gonna fall straight down like this. Yeah, and enjoy the fact that nothing can hurt me. Try to get some rings there, but I also don't want to waste too much time. We got a bonus stage. What it'll be this time? This thing again. So I should be able to get a couple of rings from this, right? Maybe if I can actually, I don't know if that counted or not. Oh no. Come on. Oh, it's catching up to me. I don't like it. No! Wait, wait, uh, okay. <laughs> See ya, death egg zone, we're back to it. Only a couple more rings now. Come on, we got it. Oh, they are everywhere. But I, I can't really, oh, I can move. There we go. Oh no, I'm just trying to get through this. Uh, I don't know exactly what we're supposed to be doing. Maybe I need to hit all these buttons. There's one more yellow one that can be turned red. This is incredibly disorienting. No, no, no. I'm almost there, maybe Tails can hit it for me. Jeez, I am not hitting the things I wanna hit. Because the controls on this are super floaty. Oh, there it was. Maybe. Oh, we got it. We got it. Whoa, we're going through. Looks like a big turbine. Okay. And we get a one up. You know what? We're about to go really fast through this whole thing again. That is so neat looking. I love it. You know what? Yeah, we're going to go for it. I'm going to activate hypersonic. It looks like I. Oh, you know what? I could do this again. There we go. 
This might be a, a drain on my rings, though. We'll end up seeing. But being able to defeat Eggman as hypersonic would be great. I thought this is less productive than if we just ran through the whole thing. Oh, there's a bunch of extra rings, so I really need those. But oh, there's the checkpoint, too. That's great. And you know what? I'll take this. If we could just get an extra shield, that's really all I need. There we go. There's a bubble shield. So it's something. Oh, man. Some extra rings for us again. Come on. Ah, oh, that's all I can get. But still, a shield, that's... We're, we're, we're gonna use something with that, right? Oh, I think we're here. So what is this thing? Oh, oh no, I'm already immediately hit. You know, it's hypersonic time then. I'm gonna hit this thing as much as we can. Come on. Got it. So I guess I'm supposed to be avoiding these spikes. That's what I'm supposed to be doing in this fight. <laughs> there we go. We got him, by the way. Oh, it's not done. We still have more. Oh, wow, wow. Okay, so I don't think it's gonna hurt me. Yeah, I'm fine. I sort of wanted to see what it's gonna do, you know, if I wasn't hypersonic. Now we just knock it away super easy. We did it. So that's this area completed, right? Is that just gonna be act one? Sonic got through act one of Death Egg Zone. So that must have been the core or something. So maybe it'll finally fall apart again. We're gonna find out. Oh, no. Whoa! We are way up here, and it's Death Egg Zone Act Two. Let's go for it. So we're practically in space right now. We're in the atmosphere. No, oh gosh, I thought that was gonna be really bad. So we are back to trying to earn up 50 rings. No, no, the reverse gravity. Come on, no, I wanted that stuff. What is going on? Whoa, that was neat. So once again, the gravity's reversed here, so I have to be very careful. Oh, and I immediately lose my shield again. That's never fun. It is so hard to tell what's going on with this stuff. I can grab that, no problem. Bounce off of you. This is very disorienting. So if I wanna, well, luckily the controls aren't really flipped. It's just Sonic that's flipped. Got it? That was actually pretty good. Well, I wanna go down there, grab that shield. This is still my favorite shield. I really like what they did with the shields in this game. It's been a lot of fun. Oh no. Can I get up there? Sort of. My timing wasn't the best. That's it though. Please don't hit me. Whoa, gravity's flipped again. I'm gonna save that shield for later maybe, or for right now. That's what I said, definitely. Ah oh, man, okay, that's really difficult to get through. But we can just hit this, flip for gravity again, and Oh, it's like teeter-tottering. Gotcha. And into here we go. Gravity flipped once more. What do I do about this thing? Um, oh, like that. <laughs> Overthought it a little bit, didn't I? I don't know if that's worth risking. Um, instead, we're going into this thing. We're just all flipped around right now. Okay, uh, so don't do that. I need to jump first, get over it, got it. Oh gosh, that's scary, I don't like it. Come on, I'm only a few rings away. Let's grab this and see what we get in another bonus stage. It's gonna be this big sphere thing again. I'm getting a little bit more used to it though, the more we go along, so that's nice. I wanna grab that one. So we have a bubble shield. You get another bubble shield for fun, I guess. Oh no. Oh gosh, I need to get up there. I'm not gonna be able to. It's hard to get too far in that bonus stage, but I guess you really don't need to. I'll grab some extra rings. We could get hypersonic, but once again, if I could just keep the shield for now. I guess I need to, or to tell how I do this. I guess like that. There we go. Whoa, Sonic, that was, that was really odd. Just run, just run. Ah, oh, <laughs> didn't quite make it. Yeah, how do I build up the speed for that, I wonder? I guess I need to... There we go, much better. I hope that I don't get zapped. So far, ooh, it was going well until that happened. We've got another speed up zone now. Once again, it's not worth using supersonic or hypersonic if I am It's gonna be bouncing around one of these things, so I don't think I can get hurt in these sections. Now this I can get hurt in, so here's a good time to chill out, because I think I get hurt in these almost every single time. 
Watch me not actually. What? Wait, what? How did I get squished? We were going down. That was so silly. All right, then if you say so. Yikes. It's fine. Let's just, uh, I wanted to get those rings, but it's fine. We know what we're doing at this point, so I just need to run up this thing. I guess not. Come on. There we go. And let's get to moving. Luckily, there is a generous amount of rings. Like, we're already back at the 26. That's not too bad. More than halfway there by one, but. Ah, oh, I thought that would go out farther. Okay, well, now not as much, but you get the idea. Come on. We're prepared for it this time, right? I sure hope so. We're going down. I'm not prepared for it. I still don't really know what squished me, though. I think that was a sort of a weird glitch. But I can go over here. Yeah, the sooner I can... Was that the missile from before, but it went behind the wall? That doesn't feel very fair. Okay, it's supposed to bounce off of this, go over here. We got it, we got it. Don't fall back down. Ooh, whoa, okay. So I need to flip the gravity again. Oh, come on, I couldn't have seen that one. And I don't know if there's too much of a way over there, but I guess I could maybe make this tilt like this and then jump up here. That didn't work. Uh, yeah, that didn't work at all. Okay, good to know. I don't have any rings left, so I just gotta really hope I don't get hit by anything silly. There we go, oh my goodness, that was the most ridiculous thing ever. Uh, but we're fine, we can go through there. This thing's trying to get me. I'm just gonna keep running. Hopefully if we just run through and away from all of our problems, maybe something will happen. I mean, at the least we got a checkpoint, so we don't have to repeat some of that. But geez, that was tough. Now we're spiraling all over the place. Okay, yeah, keep going this way then. Can I make it? Ah, not quite. Now I can. Not this guy again. He always pops up, and before I can even possibly react to him, he's throwing that spike ball at me. Okay, so where are we going? Somewhere. We've gotta be coming up on the end of this act, I'd have to imagine, it's been going on for a while. Okay, going down to the left. Don't get hit by that one. And another one. It's weird, because sometimes these are actually slower than just avoiding them. In some spots, you can jump over them and just take the path normally, and that goes a lot faster. Okay, so... Yep, right over here. We'll grab these two. Don't mind if I do. Very much appreciated that I get a shield. Hopefully I don't immediately lose it. So far, not the case. Ooh, going back down. Or up, actually. I'm trying to avoid you. <laughs> I was waiting for it to attack and it just didn't. So it started freaking me out. Oh no. Whenever we get to these sections, they're my least favorite because these missiles seemingly just fire at random times. Oh no. Oh, so each time I land on it, it changes directions. Oh no, I don't like that. So I'm guessing that means there's gonna be more missiles fired at me in a moment. Until it hits a wall, then it'll turn around. I was so focused on what was in front of me that I didn't even see that. Jeez, but at least we got a checkpoint. Something is happening. Here he is again, get him. We can't. What is this? Oh my gosh. Is this gonna be it? What do I do about that thing? Oh, I have to go up here? Sort of? Okay, I destroyed it. And this one. But I can't hit him. So what am I doing about that? Maybe if I just keep destroying his little friends. Oh no. Um. Yeah, do that, and then, oh, that was a bad idea. Okay, so we're going back up. I lost a bunch of rings. Oh, I see, I see. Okay, wait a minute. Yeah, so bring them down here, and then we go through again, but at just the right time, so that the spikes fly up and hit him too. Gotcha. Now, on the way down, that doesn't hurt him as much, or at all. <laughs> so that is definitely tricky to do. I'm trying to figure it out. Well, luckily they stop right there, so they don't end up hitting me. Come on. There's two more hits on him. I got it now. Oh, and that one did hit him on the way down. Here we go. Ooh, a little bit more. 
Because when they fall, they break, and some spikes shoot out of them that way. Sometimes? I guess not, maybe. I don't know what makes the spikes fall out of them. But that hit him again. Okay, ready. Uh, be careful. Oh, it's okay. He's gotta be getting low at this point. This is going on for a while. I think we're doing the right thing now. I don't, I don't see what else we would do here. Oh, there it is! Nice! And where's Eggman? You get back here! We're not done with you! And here we go, the death egg zone again, but it's not an act. Uh-oh. Could it be again? Oh, I was supposed to, I didn't realize I was supposed to do something. <laughs> I'm sorry, I was busy watching whatever that was. Is it the, it's the robot again, but it's huge this time. Okay, let's run. Let's run, that thing's gonna chase me. Oh no, and I don't have any rings to help me either. Oh goodness, it is gigantic. It's trying to get me with its weird robot fingers. I don't like it. See, so let's just try to hit them where I can. Cause I think that's what we're supposed to do. You don't get much time to do that though. Come on, ah. So if I stay in between them, aha. Whoa, that was cool. That's the trick, right there. Stay in between them, and then we can bounce between them all crazy. That's awesome. Got it? There's a couple more. Yeah, no match for us now. Ooh. Let's stay over here. So I have one more finger left. Ah, oh, I missed it. Come on, run over here. Gotcha. There it is. Is he really defeated because I just broke his fingers? No way, yeah, he's back. Oh, that might not be a good idea. Just run, just run. Ah, I might, I don't know what to do. You can see the super emerald in there though. Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm trying to run, but obviously we can't really too much. Oh gosh, this is different, this is different. Ah, that's not what he did last time. Do I hit him in any way? I don't know. Uh. That, okay, hitting him made that happen. I can't duck under it, so maybe I am I not supposed to hit him? This is giving me some memories of Sonic 2 where it's very hard to experiment because there's no room for error, but I'll try it again. Okay, so what I, I think, yeah, what I do, whoa, is I gotta time it just right. Oh, that is intense, so let's try this again. Hit it, and then, ah, uh, oh, I couldn't quite, but you get the idea, I'm supposed to let it rev up and then jump over it right as it blasts. That is intense. So far, so good. Ah, it's so scary though. And we got him! Wow! We didn't really need that many hits then. What do we do now? The egg robot's going down. Is that really going to be it? Of course it's not. You still have that super emerald, huh? Come on, get him, get him. Oh, the debris is falling everywhere. We need to run fast, but not too fast, right? I don't know. Oh, Sonic, go! Sonic, go! Run! Oh man, maybe it's not a good idea to hit him. It's so hard to tell. No, come on. Ah, uh, you're kidding me. Okay, we're chasing after him again. Luckily, this debris doesn't seem like it can hit me, so I'm just trying to, oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. Hit this stuff at an angle where I don't fall off the side, because it starts falling so quick, and I don't really know. There we go, we got it. Oh my goodness, give me that emerald. We gotta hop onto it or something. What do I do? The whole place is falling. Did we make it? The doomsday zone. Whoa, and we're hypersonic. Okay, so we're flying around space right now. This is so cool. And do I just, yeah, I guess I just fly around and enjoy space a little bit. Where did Eggman go? I'm not really sure, but I'm just trying not to get hit by any asteroids. Keep these rings up so I don't lose hypersonic in the middle of space, that would probably not work out so well. I don't think that normal hedgehogs can breathe in space, so I think this hyperform is our best bet. These missiles are coming in from everywhere, though. I don't know if going up farther ahead does anything for me. Whoa, there's missiles everywhere, though. This is crazy. I must be doing something right, though, right? I hope. Oh gosh, hitting those doesn't seem like too good of an idea. There we go, there we go. Ooh, I'm moving all over the place, but I'm still not seeing Eggman. His robot moves really fast through space. Oh, we did it, we made our way through the asteroid field. Where's he at? There he is. How do I hit him, <laughs> like that? Does that work? I think so. 
Come on, come on. Oh, I'm flying back. I don't know if that's doing damage is the thing. It, it might be. Okay, that definitely is. So I'm just gonna keep flying at him and hopefully it does something eventually. Maybe I gotta make his own missiles hit him? Yeah, that's what I have to do. So let's fly around and try to make his own missiles run into his ship. We have to make it hit Eggman directly. You can see the little Death Egg robot popping out of the front of it. There we go, there we go, come on. This is working. We got him! You're not getting away this time, Eggman! And down he goes. I don't know if we can keep up with him down there. He's just gonna crash back down to Earth. Oh no, we're not done yet. He has so many extra plans just in case something goes wrong. We're back through the asteroid field, but this time I can get some more rings, which is always great. I'm guessing, yeah, if we run out of rings, it's sort of game over, we gotta try again. So I'm trying to be really careful, things like that. Oh man. Uh, got it. Come on. Not as many rings this time, that's for sure, but the faster we can defeat him, the more rings we'll be able to save, so just gotta be careful of that too. Okay. No, no missiles being launched at me this time though, so that does make it a little bit easier to survive, I suppose. That's sending me back though, probably isn't, I don't think. Okay, there's a good stash of them. Just trying to look around wherever they can be. Cluster. Oh no, okay, so going up there doesn't seem to help too much. We're over 50 of them now. Where did he go? Eggman, you flew off way too fast for me. This goes on for a while. I think we made our way through. Oh, no, never mind. Spoke too soon. Because I can press the jump button to move forward a little bit faster, which can sometimes be useful, but I don't know. Okay, there he is. So maybe I really have to do that to catch up to him. Am I the one doing things wrong here? <laughs> I think so. Okay, hold on, let's speed back up and see if I can't catch up to him. Oh, there we go. This whole time I thought I was just trying to find him. Nope, I had to hold forward. That's so silly. Come on, come on. Where'd you go? There you are. Come on, that's it. Ooh. Come on, he's getting lower and lower. That was pretty good. And we got him! See ya, Eggman! Okay, this time for real, he's crashing down. We stole the emerald. He's not getting it back from us. We're too powerful for that now. So after a really long journey, it looks like we've finally done it. We've saved the world. We've retrieved that super emerald one more time. There we go. So it's safe with Tails now, hopefully. Can I do anything here? I, I can't. So I think that's really gonna be the end of the game. Hopefully we can go back to Knuckles, return the emerald and restore everything to how it rightfully was. So here we are, I think this was Angel Island, right? Something like that. We're coming back, Knuckles. This is quite an amazing adventure though. It just kept going and going too. I thought it would have ended much sooner, but it really is the length of two Sonic games with how it's Sonic 3 and then Sonic and Knuckles. Whoa, wait a minute. The island is taking flight once again. That is so cool. So yeah, it restores power back to the island. And there we have it. Goodbye Knuckles, I hope you enjoy your big emerald. He seems appreciative. So we're going back home, and there we go. That's the ending of Sonic 3 and Knuckles. I did have a ton, ton of fun for this game. I do think Sonic 2 is still my favorite, but this one was such a grand adventure. The fact that it was sort of two games in one, we had new characters, new places to go, new abilities and stuff, and the new form of Hypersonic. There was a lot to enjoy in this one, and I can see why it is most people's favorite out of the four. So I'd love to hear which one is your favorite, Sonic 1, 2, 3, or CD. I would love to hear all about it. But yeah, this was a fantastic adventure, and this was the end of our Sonic Story Mode playthrough. 
we were able to get through all of it and see the end, get all of the Chaos Emeralds and Time Stones and Supersonic, Hypersonic, all the things for all the games. And that's really exciting for me because I haven't really even beaten too many of these games. I think I've maybe beaten Sonic 1 once. I can't really even remember. But to play through them all and get them all, uh, like all of the extra collectibles along the way is super exciting to me. So I'm glad that we were able to do that together and have a lot of fun with that. And we're still technically not quite done this game. There's still so much more we can do, including playing through the games as different characters. I know that playing through this game as Knuckles is basically in a, a different game entirely, as far as I've heard. There's different boss fights, different events. So maybe we should start with that one first, but there's things like going back and playing Knuckles in Sonic 1 and Tails in Sonic 1, and same thing for Sonic 2 and CD. So if you guys wanna see me do additional playthroughs with different characters, be sure to let me know. But beyond that, in Sonic Origins, there's extra content as well. There's things like the challenge mode we could check out. So if you guys want more action in this game, let me know for sure, because I've had a ton of fun playing this through and it looks like there's just still more for us to enjoy. So yeah, it's been great exploring some classic Sonic. And if somehow that's not enough for you, we have some other older Sonic series that we've done that can keep you interested in the meantime. We played through Sonic Colors Ultimate last year. We played through Sonic Mania a few years ago. We played through Team Sonic Racing if you wanted a racing game. So yeah, hopefully all that keeps you entertained as we're waiting for the new game, Sonic Frontiers, which comes out sometime this year. I don't think they've confirmed a release date yet. As of recording this, I'm just not sure, but I'm super interested in it. It looks like a really interesting take on a new generation of Sonic being totally open world in a way. So whenever that comes out, I'll certainly be playing it. I don't know if I'll be any good at it, but it'll definitely be worth a try. So yeah, looks like the special th thanks are coming up on the credits. So I'm sure we're about wrapped up here. But yeah, there, there's still a lot to explore in this game in the meantime. So we'll definitely be staying busy. I think there's even a museum. So we'll have to look into how we can earn stuff up for the museum. Um, I would love to look through all that. But for right now, there goes Hypersonic, Sonic the Hedgehog 3 and Knuckles. That's great. And there we go, a happy little finishing sequence. That looks so cool. All the characters are sort of hanging out. Do I have to press anything? Okay, I can just press. There we go, we did it! So what happens now with Eggman finally defeated for the millionth time? He's not feeling so good about it. <laughs> Aww. Oh no, Don't, he's gonna pop it! <laughs> he's gonna do it! Oh, you know what, I think he deserves it. The end. Oh, and what's happening now? With all of Sonic's adventures finished, the whole world has fallen apart? I don't know what's going on. Is there more? Or is this more of like a collage of everything we've explored? Okay, here's Knuckles and Amy. Oh wow. What did they find? I guess they're just destroying more of the remains of Eggman's robots and stuff. This is so neat. Wow. Whoa, he's riding the missile too? But of course we have our friends on our side. Yeah. Great job. That was an awesome ending to our entire adventure. Wow. That was a really fun cutscene. All titles cleared, congratulations. You can watch the special Sonic Origins ending in the museum. So you know what, since this is our last episode of this main story mode, let's go do that right now. Let's take a look at the museum over this way and look at the movies. Is there a special ending we didn't see? Because as you can see, the Sonic Origins ending. Okay, I think that's what we just saw then. That just came up on the screen. So what else is over here then? I haven't really seen anything in the museum. I think, that's about it. Well, there is some other things here. Sonic Mania Adventures. So those are from, I think, Sonic Mania. Maybe we'll play through all those at some point. We'll look through them. With that being said, there's even a premium collection thing which we can use coins on. A lot of the stuff we'll get to sooner or later. I think there's gonna be a lot of bonus episodes to this series as we find everything. But yeah, that was really neat. There's also illustrations and sounds and like I said, Tons of things to collect and figure out. But for right now, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Sonic Origins. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.